What is up, ladies and gentlemen? I am out here with Jason, and we are gonna be hanging out at King of the Hammers for today. King of the Hammers is a nine day event. People spend two weeks out here hanging out, wheeling, crawling, and enjoying the races. But for us, we're gonna be experiencing King of the Hammers just one day. I know Jason is excited to finally bring his Jeep out. There's a lot that has been done. Like these massive needle grapplers. I think they are what, 42s? Yeah, 42. With 20, in 20 inch speed locks. Makes my little tires look like they are 30s. 35s. 42s, baby. It feels so good to be back, guys. You guys want to know some background on Johnson Valley. My first time camping in this Toyota Tacoma was out here in Johnson Valley with my cousin. If you guys haven't seen that video, I'll link it down below. It's crazy. You guys won't even recognize the Tacoma, but it was such a blast. We got to explore. And That's now to know... camping on the side of the mountain? No, that's uh, Chocolate Mountain. Uh, to be able to come back and experience such a crazy event and race out here with this type of terrain, it's pretty nuts. So I know Jason's excited. I'm excited too. Some people go crazy out here and just break their stuff. So let's see, let's see what's in store for us today, guys. Dude, what'd you think of that that car that almost split by hitting that rock? I almost took out the cameraman too. Dude, yeah, I for sure thought it was gonna somersault down the hill. And did you see that rock that almost nailed the guy? Just, poor old man was just sitting there hanging out, living Maybe life, and life. he would have been gone in an instant if that if that rock would have hit him. Uh, but a gentleman next to us was telling us that you can't trust anybody out here. Even the, even the drivers, man, like they're professional, but when the terrain is being altered by every driver that's yeah. pushing through, dude, that's, that's scary, dude. Yeah, I mean, you saw some big rocks being thrown up. Yeah. They were going through, so. What'd you guys think of that footage? Hmm? 
Gnarly, huh? So this guy wants to do donuts. I told him not to do it. That he's gonna end up flipping over because the terrain here is not flat. Not exaggerating, this is what his suspension feels like. So after watching these guys completely bash these $200,000, $300,000 machines that they made for this race, it's time to finally eat some food. Nothing fancy, we're just here for the day. But if you look around here, all that does being picked up, man. This is like a little city of its own. If you guys haven't checked out King of the Hammers, I would highly recommend coming, at least for a day, maybe two days if you love camping. I love camping, but fortunately, we didn't get permission to camp this time around. So, we're gonna eat some hot dogs and get back on the dirt road.